I think the more pressing question is, why don't you carry a lapel mic and a dictaphone with you when you're at work? Okay, the last time I tried to record a video here at work, the sound quality was awful in this big echoey room. I'm hoping the fact I've got the lapel mic on means it'll be a little bit better today. I am recording. That's a bonus. There is a reason for this as well. This heap of junk, my laptop, is properly broken. Well, the laptop's not broken. The hard drive is broken. Um, I brought it in. The, uh, the very helpful nerd crew here over in IT have had a look at it. There are bad sectors or something on the hard drive so it's basically fried it's the second drive it's the drive that i use for the storage stuff so the the operating system all my save games all that stuff that is on my ssd that should all be fine i just don't have a way to store render video at the moment so i have a solution the solution involves a wonderful man called one true nerd if you don't yet subscribe to his channel now is the time to do that um, he does daily football manager content just like I do. He's great. He's, by coincidence, working in Peterborough today. He says it's a coincidence. I wonder if he snuck into my house and broke my hard drive just so that he can meet me. He's found me a hard drive that I can purchase for a very reasonable price from PC World. So I've got that ordered. I'm heading straight there after work. I'm then meeting him in PC World car park so he can get his manly screwdriver set out of his pocket take the back off my laptop, swap the hard drives over, and in theory, it should just work, and I should be able to, A, edit this video on there tonight, and B, should be able to get some Football Manager stuff recorded out onto the other channel for tomorrow as well, or today, I guess, when you're watching this. Basically, if you're watching this, it means it worked. If you're not, it means he's a con artist, and he's legged it with my laptop, probably my camera, probably the keys to my car, and whatever else he's managed to get out of me. Never meet a man that you meet found online. There's probably a moral to that story somewhere. But yeah, fingers crossed, it all gets sorted today. And then the arguments with scam computers who I bought this from in August can continue. They want me to send the whole laptop back to them so that they can test the whole thing and decide whether it needs replacing. I need that laptop. I can't send it to them and have it with them for a couple of weeks. That's mad. I need to be able to produce content now. So what I'm gonna do is once I've got the old hard drive out, I'm gonna send them that. They can test that in isolation. That's the bit that's broken, they can test that. And then fingers crossed I get a refund for the hard drive through. But that's the plan. Now, fingers crossed, it works. Well, I'm here at PC World to meet one true nerd to have him fix my laptop. I think his car is parked behind me, but I don't know if he's seen me yet. Emphasize, I've never met this man before, so there's every chance he's gonna be some kind of murderer. And I've got everything I own with me. I've got my laptop, camera, iPad, I've got like four grand worth of kit on me. If he is a murderer, or a mugger, I'm about to get ruined. But I'm pretty sure that this is him here, so I'm gonna wander over to the path here and casually just make sure that I don't, it is him, it is him, look, there he is. I'm not going to kill you. It's well, fine. I've just I've got it all on video, so just in case you do kill me, um, at least they'll find the camera. But they might and, not. I, well, I'll be. But when you sell the camera, I'll be better than that. Uh, maybe. <laughs> hey, I've met another YouTube man. This is the first time I've met another YouTube man. Shake my hand, sir. I'm shaking your hand. Hurrah! This is rather weird. It is weird. <laughs> um, not I need. At all. I need to lock my car and find my wallet. One moment. There you go. He's he's not a murderer. I don't well, he's not murdered me yet. That's a positive. The con's begun. He's holding my laptop. <laughs> the plan now is I have to go into to not into Toys R Us, into PC World, buy the hard drive while he sits in his car and starts unscrewing the back of it. Guarantee, I guarantee I am gonna come back why, to this why spot. Don't want a broken laptop. The car's got because you know how to fix it. <laughs> <laughs> never gonna see that laptop again. If there's never ever another video, it's because one true nerd stole my laptop. It was all a ruse. Never met that man before. I've just left my laptop, my thousand pound laptop, with a man I've only spoken to on the internet before, wearing a hoodie. This is not going well for me, is it? Hard drive acquired. Now we have to hope he's still at the car. Genuinely a little bit worried at the moment. This could be, I mean, we've been talking on the internet for over a year. This could be the best con in the history of the world. 
I think that's still his car there. I need to phone Anna in a minute so to let her know I'm still alive. Got to give her the three rings. The three rings that indicate he's not a murderer or a laptop thief. Look, he's still here. He's still. What are you doing to my laptop? You've got the back off. Wow, that's what the inside of a laptop looks like. Yeah. Is it dusty? Look at the dirt you've put on that. It was beautiful and clean. I'm sure it bloody wasn't. Yeah, it was lovely. It was Jesus Christ. See, look how neat and tidy that is. That's how you don't you ignore the mess. Um, <laughs> that is but, that is an impressive. That's a lot of screws. That would have taken me about a month to get all them out of there. I think I'd have got halfway through and just bought a new laptop. Is this the right thing that I've bought? On his recommendation, I'll point it out. So if it's not, send him a bill. So that's what's broken, is it? That's what's broken. Uh, that's what I'm going to send back to Scan and demand a refund on. Is that your, that's your SSD there. Okay. See, computer science degree, I don't know what goes on inside a computer. <laughs> we got the option at the end of the first year to drop hardware and I dropped it like a stone. So, to add, add pressure that I'm filming you do this. No, not at all. I'm sure you can... Wait, this is going to go on YouTube as a tutorial. Uh, how to, how, to swap, how to swap a laptop hard drive in a car park. Yeah, it it's going to be my first viral hit. If it is a viral hit, this is how we're paying Matt for his time. Just go to his channel, it's One True Nerd. We're not going to give him actual money, even if there's like a million views on this. Um, your chat, it's One True Nerd, isn't it? YouTube.com slash One True Nerd UK? Yes. There you go. YouTube.com slash One True Nerd UK. Um, he does football manager stuff like what I do and laptops in car parks. So you get a little bit of both. Best of both worlds. For those of you who've been enjoying my Total Extreme Wrestling series, I think I backed it up onto my SSD before he just took the hard drive out that it was on. If not, that might not be out until next week sometime. Also, you've got a, an unboxing right now. You see, this is a, a multifaceted episode for you here. Yeah, this is the unboxing of the Seagate laptop, apparently, according to the box. Seagate There's a laptop. whole laptop oh, in there. We've got internal hard drive, disk drive. Ah, well. okay. Oh, it doesn't have the hot dogs. I like that. Hot dogs, did you say? The hot dogs. Like how you hold a, a, um, a hard drive. Some retailers put like this, these like orange looking hot dogs, like as a, a way of like keeping it secure. In I kind of want to go and buy a different one now. I, I would just for that feature. Yeah. Did you want the moment of opening it or no, I at risk of dropping it? I'll, I'll break it. Okay. Yeah, he, he was admiring before the state that my laptop is in for a six month old laptop. It's terrifying, absolutely. I use it every day. I, I use multiple computers. Every I use mine in the garage. It's basically a masculine manly it's tool that is used out. in the garage. Plus I dropped it like five times onto the stone floor. So that probably didn't do the hard drive any good, did it? I, that, that is exactly why your hard drive is now dead. <laughs> is it really? I'm gonna have to edit I, that I would, out because Anna will kill me. Well, I, I would also edit it out in case Scan happened to come across your channel. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, that warranty claim you put in, uh, Mr. Kev, yeah. Uh, I hope they call me Mr. Morning. Kev, I'd like that. Yeah. Well, For the £30 hard drive that was in there, I'd be mortified. When this, when this is a viral hit, I'll have made back the hard drive money. We, I'll become one of those channels that buy stuff just to smash it because you get more money in ad revenue. That's where this is going. See, the thing is, I've thought, I've thought out how you can utilise... Obviously, you, you didn't record me at dismantling or taking off the front cover and unscrewing it all. What you can now do is reverse that footage of me when I put it back on. Absolutely. See, I'm, I'm coming up with ideas for people. Yeah. This might have to be a, a long-term collaboration here. You live locally, I assume. <laughs> you can head over to this car park once a week and we'll do tech repairs. That, that, maybe that is a thing that yeah. needs to be uh, investigated. Well, there you go. If you, if you want weekly car park technical support, we can have, we can have guests. <laughs> weekly car park technical support. <laughs> we need a thousand likes on this video by Saturday. Do you just put DNA in my computer? <laughs> I can basically clone you now. <laughs> You're inhaling a lot of Dave there, I imagine. Well, I don't think there's any dog ear in there, but general dust. That's probably not the best technique, but I don't have any... Uh, yeah, where's your there? little can of air? That, your, your pigeon's milk that you tech folk buy. Pigeon milk? Yeah. Oh, do you, do you, do you want a can of air? Oh, yes, please, I'd love to pay money for some air. Gimme, gimme, gimme. You didn't have to pay for that air, did you? No, but you've just cleaned that out. Now you're swiping the dust off into it. 
I'm starting to feel like you don't know what you're doing. I don't at all. You've just literally trusted me with your life. life. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to ruin it all. Well, my backup plan, if it still doesn't work, is I'll just tell Anna you stole it and drove off and she'll feel sorry for you that got a new one. <laughs> <laughs> but no, you've just told everyone that. So you, that's I, uh, power of editing. It's fine. I edit this channel. It's the other one I don't have <laughs> <bother> editing. <laughs> <laughs> the one that people watch doesn't get edited. We're gonna, you're gonna see me taking a selfie that I'll have tweeted in the past by the time you watch this. <laughs> That's how technology works. So, if I crouch down here like this. <laughs> and now you can see, he's probably not a murderer, which is what we'll tweet. Right, now we let Anna know that he's probably not a murderer. Oh, the, she sent me a text um, 40 minutes ago saying, are you alive? I was still sat in a meeting at work and I said, I'm still in this meeting thing. I'm leaving in a minute to see if I get murdered. That text not delivered. So she has had, <laughs> um, so let's try again and send that one. And then this one will come through as well. Um, I'm with him now. I don't think. He's a murderer. There we go. Let's see what response we get through from Anna. Oh, she's replying instantly. She's been sat there. She's been so concerned. She's not phoned me. She's not been concerned enough to phone me, but she has been concerned enough to sit there waiting for a text to come through. Yeah, exactly. Um, I'm not gonna sh hold it to the camera because there might be curse words in it for me leaving it so long. In other news, there's remarkable progress happening down here. So you weren't even taking a time lapse for it, were you? So no. You should have had an alternative intro, but no, screw that up. Well, I couldn't use that as the intro because then people would know you weren't a murderer. I've got five minutes building oh, up right. the okay. is he, isn't he murderer thing well, before we get to that. Mm. The moment of truth. Oh. You've broken it. No, it's, it's, on. it's turning on. That's, that's a minimum. Boom, in. Woohoo! You, you, could, you could even zoom in on that if you really wanted. Go on then. It's, it's that one that's the important one. Is it? So that's the new boy, the is two, it? empty, but that one is important. Awesome. So now we can throw the other one in the sea. Um, probably, I wouldn't throw it in the sea necessarily, but we do what we want with it. Coaster. Could be a coaster. That, one's, that one will be framed on the wall with August 16 you, you to like February 17 around it. Casey Neistat style like Yeah, wall. exactly. And I'll drill through it to put it into the wall and that'll be my thing that I do. A garage wall covered in hard drives. Is it normal for hard drives to only last six months by the way? No. <laughs> this is why I was suggesting uh, an SSD purely because that, yes they have a shorter, shorter lifespan potentially but they don't get damaged by shock. Yeah, so. well I treat my laptop good so you know got to say there seems to be a lot of people on Twitter who are disappointed that he's not a murderer. I don't know if that counts as trolling me or him or both. Are you going for a twofer? Mean. I'll tell you what my original plan was to do this myself. He's pressing an awful lot of buttons that I didn't know had functions. So um, yeah I wouldn't better do this myself. Is it working? We have a new hard drive. The channel is saved. Hooray he saved the channel. In theory this vlog will come out normal time. Later on today, we should have a new football manager video, in theory. Unless he's ruined me somehow with some kind of secrets in there. Adverts for his own stuff halfway through every video from now on. If I'd have thought about it, that would have been a really good idea. Could have showed me how to do a proper intro and just put yourself in there. That can be episode two of Car Park Tech Support. You can show me how to use After how, Effects. How to, after, well, that, that is a rather... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's quite suspicious anyway, like two men peering at, a, looking at a car, not actually doing anything with the car, um, yeah. and then... Well, they don't understand the premise of car park tech support. No, obviously not. Um, I think that would terrify most people. I'm waiting for the people of PC World to come out I, and ask us to move on for I, doing technical support yeah. without involving them. <laughs> why, <laughs> is that, is that man fixing your laptop? I walked into the shop and I couldn't find the email. They asked me... It works. It works. Thank you very much, sir. Um, they asked me what I'd ordered, and I just said I think it's a hard drive, and that's as much information as I had. I think it's a hard drive broken. 
I only think it's a hard. Yeah, well, I wasn't certain. You could, you just sent me a link. I followed it, clicked it, bought it. So, how many YouTube channels is this you've saved now? Quite a few. <laughs> I think. Well, Ben's, Ben's, uh, Ben's was the most extravagant. Uh, purely because I had, we had to do it over the Skype. <laughs> What, the Try, same process trying, over Skype? Well, look, trying to repair a, a master boot record over Skype is not not an easy task. You should know what one up. is. Sounds made up. Sounds like useless. hardware stuff. Useless. First class honours degree in computer science. Doesn't matter that I don't know. No. Nope. That's your box. Thank you. Is there a hard drive in there? There is a hard drive in there. I haven't. There. Do I need to check? No. Uh, Not that I can get it off anyway. Puts out loaded Kev B roll <laughs> with his own stuff. You <laughs> <laughs> monster. Um, well, that's been remarkable. If, if you are bored of football manager content on YouTube, it's his fault that there's so much of it because he keeps helping us all back online. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm going to shake your hand. Thank you very much for your all assistance. Right. And I'll turn you off. Well, his engine started. He's about to drive away. Unless this is going to be a drive by, he's officially not killed me. The laptop is working. We can make videos again. All is good with the world. What a nice man. He's actually officially saved my life. The power of YouTube. Now I need to go home because Anna needs crisps and Twixes and stuff for Sprocklet. Probably not crisps. Unless there's been a development since yesterday's round.